What's up guys? So I've been getting a ton of questions about how to wrap your hand so I decided to do a video tutorial and kind of show you guys. This hand wrap particularly is going to be for people with bad knuckles or if your knuckles hurt a lot as you can see there I have a broken knuckle that I never got fixed. Um, but there's tons of different ways that you guys can wrap your hands. Uh, look all over YouTube. There are tons of different videos. This one is just particularly the way that I like to do it. You're going to start out by completely unrolling your hand wraps and then from there you are actually going to create a padding that's going to go over your knuckles. Now when you create this padding you want to make sure to have your fingers wide so that way the padding is nice and thick, it's long, it can cover all your knuckles and there's no exposed knuckles um, that, that can get injured throughout this. We're going to go around about six to seven times all depending on how thick you like your padding. From there, you're going to place them directly over your knuckles. Don't place them too far forward or too far back. And then you're going to secure it to your hand by going one time around with the wraps and make sure that you secure it on there really tightly. From there, you're going to take it back towards your pinky and towards your wrist, and you're going to begin lacing the wrap in between your fingers. You want to make sure that you get in between each individual finger. And again, this will help uh, keep that padding in place. So that way it doesn't move around and your knuckles are well protected. From there, you're going to go to what's called the cleanup. You're going to go back towards your pinky, around your knuckles, and across the palm of your hand. And then you're going to secure it even more and then go back across town, down towards the bottom of your pinky. From there, we're going to secure our thumb. You're going to go around and you're going to go around your thumb two times, making sure to secure it tightly. Uh, don't leave any loose wrap in there. And from here, it's kind of optional. This is kind of the finishing touches. You can go around your wrist a few more times to help secure that wrist. Or like I like to do is protect that metacarpal a little bit and go back with one of those X figures around the hand. And from there, I just finish off at the wrist. Make sure that after you guys uh, finish up with your wrap, you guys pull all that loose uh, wrap on, on the palm of your hand pull that in tight so we can make a good fist make sure to check make sure that it's nice and tight nice and snug and it's not going to come loose as you guys uh, do your training and do your drilling but that's how you do your wrap